Hello, I'm Maynard Eaton, and this is SCLC TV. Of course, joined by our president and our CEO, Dr. Charles Steele Jr. We talk about SCLC, and one of the leaders and Dr. King's close aide, uh, Reverend Andrew Young, is now as we speak in the hospital, been there a few, a few days. Uh, he was a major part of the early days of this organization, was he not? That's correct. Uh, I was just talking to uh, <coughs> uh, one person that really uh, uh, knew and worked with uh, Ambassador Young, but they said he's going to be okay, and he's back at home. So we, we just thank God for that. What a legend in his own right. I think so. I mean, he, he kind of set the tone for civil and human rights activism and then went on to be an ambassador and Atlanta mayor, right? So. That's correct. I mean, and uh, Ambassador Young has never turned us down whenever we needed him in terms of our convention, in terms of his support, and uh, even, uh, you know, monetarily. You know, he made contributions to our uh, organization and the projects. And we just thank God for a legend of, of that magnitude. Speaking of legends, you're <coughs> kind of carrying on your legendary status, if you will. You're traveling to Brazil? Is this, uh, you having some exotic vacation over there, son? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're so kind, uh, Mr. Eden. Uh, as you know, I don't take vacations. My wife and I uh, want to take vacation, but s many times things just come up. The work. Huh? The work. And uh, people and this say, is work. Huh? This is work. You know, people say, well, you go here, you go there, many places around the world. And many times my wife is with me and says, oh, I know y'all really take a, a good break. There's no break. And particularly when people ask us to come, they already have our planned out schedule. Yeah, there's always a schedule for them, for us to bring. And we don't uh, resent that or regret that. We want to be helpful in those uh, roles. Yeah, I'll be going to um, several cities uh, through uh, Brazil, the country itself. But the most important thing is that uh, I'll be talking to, from my understanding, from the uh, people who said no is up in Brazil that I'll be talking to uh, roughly 25 to 30 million people over a period of one week. That in itself is very encouraging because many, many times folks won't let me talk 30 minutes to them, you know, because they say, well, that's Charles. We'd have heard him before. And I understand that. But repetition. But Brazilians have not heard you before. Brazilians have not heard me before. Repetition, what many people don't realize, repetition is the mother of skill. Just like reading the Bible. You can't read the Bible 10 times, 15, 20. You read the Bible all the time. And each time you read the Bible, you, learn something you get something different. This trip is to speak about human rights and poverty in Brazil. We talk about how beautiful Brazil is, but it's also a, a hotbed of poverty. A hotbed of poverty. Do you hit it on the head like our uh, uh, international uh, chairman of the board, Dr. Bernard Lafayette, a legend in his own right, always say, Charles, we have an international poor pain campaign, poor people campaign. We have an international uh, uh, responsibility for poor people. And this is the international poor people campaign that we are embarking upon. And to have them to reach out to us. Oh, and by the way, Puerto Rico, uh, the mayor herself will be at our convention from San Juan, Puerto Rico. And it's sad the way uh, people there <coughs> that's in relationship with us as a territory. The Puerto Ricans are still without light in many places. They were treated horribly. Treated I'm horribly. Sorry, I said, maybe you won't say they were treated horribly. I agree with you. Let me say it. Treated very horribly. But she's going to be at our convention. So, come here. We'll be talking more about the convention in future weeks. It's coming up soon. That's one of the highlights of Mayor of Puerto Rico. And, of course, we'll hear more about your trip to Brazil, which is coming up soon. Absolutely. And just got back from Marks, Mississippi, as you know. Traveling man. I'm Maynard Eaton. I'm right here at the office. See you next week. <laughs>